All right, folks. Here's the update for uh, Tuesday, the uh, 21st of May, uh, 2019. Seems like I have to answer that question every day right. to somebody. As well as giving my birth. I should be getting a lot of birthday cards next year because everybody that walks to the room, I have to state my name and tell them what my birthday is. So, um, of course, new people, I tell them I'm Donald Trump. Um, I should show them the picture of when I did the Donald Trump impersonation at work. Um, but anyhow, so uh, today was um, a lot of what they call um, um, evaluation day to get me ready for a discharge tomorrow. So I'm repeating a lot of the exercises of when I first came here, you know, Saturday, was it the 10th or the 11th, um, and doing comparison. Positive thing was that all improvement in everything, um, balance is getting better. I actually did um, on a teeter totter some bunting to, uh, with a ball, a tennis ball, that they, they, which was a pretty good exercise for balance and uh, able to bunt. So I laid, uh, I think I got down uh, 10 of the 12 bunts, uh, the, and the ones I didn't get down were five balls. So um, it's not like I whiffed on them. Um, I did want to take a full swing on one and drive one, but I, I didn't do it. Um, but they, because they had that big, bat they didn't have like a little wiffle ball bat i said do you have a wiffle ball bat and they go nah so um of course always trying to make it challenging um so uh, again uh went through some of the walking and stability tests and balance tests and did well um so i got freedom back today basically they let me walk around the room without uh having supervision so going to the bathroom uh without having somebody look at you was a uh, great um a great feeling and be able to move around and walk I'll probably hit my 10,000 steps today which is you know halfway to my daily average so that, that's a that's good um, also uh, I mentioned uh, yesterday around the Optune um, device that will be put on my head uh, and a clinical trial uh, when I post this video to the play playlist I'll add the links if you want to kind of look at pictures of what will be on my head and some videos that you can see about it. It's pretty interesting um, from you know what they'll be doing and stuff like that. I can have this device on me for a year or more um, and walk around with it. So um, just a little you know level of expectation and have to get used to it. Um, but it's only I think with the batteries like the biggest thing, which is, I think is two pounds. So that's not too bad. Um, the uh, started getting back to work. Took some calls today from fellow All-Staters, as well as replies for uh, meeting appointments. Um, probably, I might actually work on a presentation tonight, um, depending on how I feel. Um, like I said, I'll probably do about four to five miles today walking, which, you know, it's been a, I haven't done that, I don't know how long, since probably like three weeks. Um, so I, I might get a little tired and have to stop doing that. Um, other than that, i um, looking forward to getting home tomorrow. Uh, my neighbor, who's a contractor installed the bar for the shower and I have the, the seat already put together that um, I'm trying to, you know, more of a safety concern. Then I started thinking about it, you know, once I have the radiation and chemo, I make it tired or something like that. So it's probably, you know, safe to do and, and have that. So, and then when I got th thinking about it a little further, I said, you know, why don't they just install that in all bathrooms now in people's homes? Because when I saw this fall demonstration or presentation, excuse me, the amount of people that fall in the United States every year, I can't remember the numbers. I have to, I'll get the presentation and it'll be one of my video segments on that. But it was just amazing, you know. Uh, and just to have it built in your house when you're having a house built, you might want to consider it uh, for safety factors with kids. And the amount of people that fall in the bathroom is, is, is like, I think 33 or 35 percent. Yeah, don't quote me that until I get the presentation. Um, again, challenges with the food service. Okay, so I got dinner circled that I should have the mixed vegetable medley. Again, it was missing, missing, but you know, so Terry will bring me my vegetables that I need. Not a problem. Um, didn't let me bother me and didn't get upset this time. Just said, hey, just send an email to the food director and tell them that it was missing. I don't want the food brought up. Making my point. Um, let's see, other than that, that's about it. Tomorrow, 10 o'clock, I should be getting in the car and heading home. And uh, looking forward to, you know, see Lexi and just the neighbors and getting back home. The uh, other thing is, um, you know, I have to work out the transportation. Oh, Friday, this Friday, I start my outpatient therapy. So I'll 
be back in Bryn Mawr, but as an outpatient. And they do new evaluations, which was kind of like weird to me. Like, why would they do new evaluations when they already had the evaluations? Well, what I learned is that when they did the evaluations here in the in-house, when you're in-house, the goal is to get you back home. The outpatient therapy is my goal. Where do I want to be? So I want to be able to fish, I want to be able to cut the lawn, use chainsaws, climb trees, climb ladders, get on roofs, um, hook a fish, you know, tie a fly, whatever. Um, so anyhow, so that's going on with that. Um, nurses are coming in right now um, to do some um, have two pills to give two me. Pills to give me. So see, they scan me, my birth date, I'm 4 six, 62. Okay. I'm not sure if it hit. Uh, and then uh, I'll get my two pills, and uh, I'm down to two pills. So, um, and then um, we'll go from there. Um, looking forward for Terry to come tonight so I can go out for a walk, uh, see Lexi tomorrow. Um, you know, I think um, some people are going to stop by uh, the house once I get home, which will be great to see people again. And again, the emails, the text messages. I mean, you know, I, got, I don't know if I said it yesterday in the video blog, but I mean, I got like six or seven text messages from people. Hey, you didn't update your video blog today. When are you going to do it? <laughs> so yesterday, uh, you know, the, tr the travel to Jeff and ever So that was pretty cool, I thought. Um, so other than that, you know, a good, good day of physical therapy. Um, I'm feeling stronger. I'm looking forward to getting home, getting back in the swing of things next week, a little bit more normalcy. And uh, then, like I said, Friday we start the outpatient, and then next week I got to start going down to Jeff for the beginning of radiation. Uh, I believe that's Tuesday. So, um, but that's all I have. I, like I said, I'll post the links uh, on this video in the YouTube playlist to the sites of the Optune, which is the device that I'll be wearing, um, you know, during radiation and probably uh, for about a full year at least. Um, Take care, everybody. Have a great night. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Stay well.